at the wide receiver position, there's huge names that everybody oh, right. loves. This is one of the reasons why I thought maybe you want to take a running back that you like earlier because I just knew that there were going to be some of these guys we love. Mike Williams, Jason, Sammy Watkins, mm -hmm. Robbie Anderson, Chris Alshon Godwin. Jeffrey, Chris Godwin, DJ Moore, Dante Pettis. These are all – we're on our short wait. This is the fifth round. We make a pick. We wait four picks. We pick again. I mean, I'm not I'm not going to be happy or, or I'm not going to be unhappy with any of these wideout options. My vote is James White, but I'm going to hand the pick to Mike. Ooh. Oh, I like that. I like putting Mike on the spot here. This is this is why when you're – and this is something important, Foot Clan. When you're – like, you should be mock drafting. Don't just listen to mock drafts. Go and do your own. It prepares you so well. And when you do it, don't just draft – exactly who you're going to draft in the draft in order to be water as we stay say and and know how to be flexible you have to take guys that you wouldn't necessarily take at positions you wouldn't necessarily take to say oh yeah you know what if i'm at the 10 spot and i go three wide receivers out of my first four picks i i've got so many wide receivers i like in the fifth sixth seventh round and no running backs and you you learn that way i am going to open the antibiotics Pour it onto the to the uh, the applesauce because this is not a pill that you can swallow oh, in the fifth no. round. I'm taking Lamar Miller. Oh no! You I only, thought that was your whole analogy for taking James White, and I was oh be never happy. never. The thing about kind of looking back and saying, "Hey, there's a bunch of other wideouts that I like." I don't think that I feel any different about Lamar Miller or James White there than I would have felt about missing out on Ingram or Drake or Lindsey or Montgomery. So I don't think taking Edelman was the wrong choice there. I think the more interesting thing is we backed ourselves into that position by taking Julio and Juju. It was Juju. One, it was the, two. Yeah, yeah, it was the second round a bypass. Could have taken Gurley. Gurley, James Conner. I'm very happy with this team. Yeah, okay. look. I, I I like the stability of Miller and the carry count just just with the Josh Jacobs rookie. <laughs> yes. This major. is one of those things where this is a roster where at the end, I don't know that you're going to get the votes – but if you go into an actual fantasy football season with this roster, it's going to do I, I think it's gonna do very well. Hey everybody, thanks for watching. If those were the best few minutes of your life, you should probably click the subscribe button and check out a full length episode.